Hello my friends and welcome to Flamer, Sergeant, Chemist and Riot Fest. So I want to give the Flamer and the Chemist a little bit of a boost from uh, from the, the Sergeant, Riot for defending. I think this will be a great one if we are lucky enough to get acceptable opponents. Uh, this will be interesting and fun. Let's see how it goes. Ready to roll. We are starting with one white school. As you know, and uh, I'm taking the tear gas and another tear gas, why not? And yeah, this should be interesting because the surgeon would give uh, loads of strength to the chemist and the flamer, they should be really good. Hopefully we are going to get a... Um, a actually we are going to get good bases until the end. So we can have another fest that is completed and I wish I, wish, <laughs> I wish I can do that. There are not many that I actually managed to do. So first of all let's see how many we can spawn and how fast I'm using the rally flag. This is not too bad to be honest with you. We kind of have loads of uh, units already, that's 11. It's better than uh, having uh, three units. Anyway, let's see. Let's see how they do against structures. That's quite a lot of structure for one white uh, <laughs> school. But fair enough. That means we might as well get some veterans, and that would be really good. Right, the structures are going down really quickly. You can see it's. If the flamer is shooting, the structures are actually down instantly. That's, that's amazing, loads of loads of structures. I didn't look, I think this is a 9000 plus space on one white school. Anyway, it's quite accessible and it's really interesting to see from for a first start on a fest. <laughs> we are against uh, chemists as well. That will not affect my chemists, but it would the rest of the units. Doesn't really matter. Now I want to see if we are able to to destroy some walls. So let's see if that happens. Not really. Anyway, the surgeons are really are really good against walls, and if the flamers are shooting, it is amazing. They literally melt the walls and that's amazing. That gives me loads of hope. I should have used the <laughs> the decoy from the beginning. See how unlucky I can be. At this base I got two tear gas with me and uh, I was against chemists. <laughs> I should have have obviously decoys but I thought there will be other units and I said oh, I'll take uh, tear gas instead. Anyway, it's fair enough. Uh, we have already rank 2 veterans and this it will be amazing to, to end up with rank 2 veterans or rank 3 on the first fight. That's not common, it's quite unusual actually. So guys, if you have any ideas, if you want to, to see any units, just let me know in the comment section. I'm trying my best to reply to all the comments, so I will get back to you. Come on. Boom, the HQ. I like how I how the flames are there and uh, with the, the gas, with the toxic gas. It's, it is amazing. We got a full squad of veterans, plus two, in case we want to change something. And uh, let's see the rewards. Good, 20k uh, munition. That's amazing. Right, guys. Now let's move to to white school. And that's complicated. Mm, struggle already, huh? A bombardier base, which is uh, quite a struggle. Anyway. We should be alright, we have 4 units instead of 3, I don't know how to name this episode, but I hope it will be a long video. 
because I'm having lots of fun here. It is amazing to, to fight with uh, those units and they are fun and they are really strong. When they manage to shoot, they are actually doing a brilliant, brilliant job. Um, come on, okay. Load, thank you. Let's see this base, let's see what we can do. We do have 10 veterans, which it will be quite helpful if it will actually do the trick. Five units, the volunteer worked once. Let's see. I can't wait to open more unit crates to get more hero perks, so I, at some point in time I will be able to have all my units perked out with the perks that I want so I don't have to change them around. So that's my next goal, it will be quite complicated to do it but hopefully, hopefully really soon. I'm, I'm doing great on uh, ultra perks, normal perks so I just have to keep opening unit crates. I was quite unlucky on that. but. Uh, I'm I'm quite happy with what I have, so I use straight away the the decoy because that rocketer could and probably would uh, do some damage to my units, and I don't want to lose my veterans. To be honest with you, let's see if they can reach that sniper tower. They already did it. It's like a piece of cake. That's how it was. And now we have bombardiers, it's not a bombardier base that I thought it would be. They are still really dangerous for my units. Uh, I want most of them to survive and hopefully I can get rank 3 uh, veterans and that will be a cool cool chance on uh, our nightmare, which is next battle. Uh, I want to win that. If I don't win I will actually be disappointed because it's a good squad. I like it, I like it. And I have a few rank 3 veterans, maybe by the end of this I will have more. I don't know if there is any threat left, so I might be lucky. Oh it is one, that rocketer. But if my units are going close, close, close and shoot, yes, flamers, yes. And take the other ones out, quick, quick, quick. And let's move to the nightmare. Hopefully I'm getting a... <laughs> One of my units died. So I'm doing that just because I want uh, more surgeons to be rank 3. Hopefully it, they will be. Let's see, let's see, yes, we have four of them, I think that will do the trick, we see how it goes, the cards, fair enough, nothing special, let's see the veterans, I can actually change some riots with, uh, with flamer, but I'll take only one, I think riots are doing a great job, I do expect loads of snipers. Well, right, our nightmare. Let's do this. I have to take proper cards, and I'll take uh, one focus fire, three k uh, munition, one decoy. We obviously need tactical boots, and now is the question: What should I get? I'll take another decoy instead of uh, focus fire because they are not brilliant against walls, long range. So. Yeah, come on, come on, we can win this, we can actually win this, never give up and don't make me be embarrassed, right, nightmare, ready to roll, tum, 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 tum. let's see, need an idea to start with, if I go and uh, put the veterans straight away and die, that will be annoying. So let's start spawning four of them and see what's going to happen. I don't see any units coming, so I don't see any barrels, I'll risk it biscuit and try to spawn more. 
And that was a mistake. Massive mistake. Uh, massive mistake. So, basically... I, I'm not allowed to do mistakes like that. <laughs> anyway, happens. Things happen. Uh, now I hope the... No, it's not going to happen. I was hoping that the commandos will destroy most of the barrels. Anyway, at least, at least we got rid of that... Uh, that uh, wall so go 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 shoot 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 come on come on come on come on yes I need some uh, some munition plus I lost uh, quite a few munition by spawning the units without thinking how can I get rid of the barrels and I beside that I have to get rid of all the sniper towers because my transport truck will not go further. Ah, this is exactly what I don't need for a free red school. And uh, I have a bad feeling. Okay, okay. Right, I can get rid of those. Hopefully, all of them. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. That's not bad. We still have a few, but that's not bad. Because every time when we spawn the units, we are losing around 1000 munition. And that's not good in our case. So I can see another lot of uh, commandos coming. This is not good. This doesn't look good at all. I do have good veterans, but... <coughs> Sorry about that. But uh, by the time I... Mm, I managed to get rid of the barrels. It will be quite. Uh, I'll be quite short on. Okay, that's good. That was good though. That was good. Come on, get rid of the other one. Yes. Now destroy a sniper tower or something. So, as I expected, I am against loads of snipers. I can see the, the three of them coming out of the base. Mm, I think it's time to spawn the big guns because we have no chance. You could see we had there only four uh, riots, no no shooting or flame gas throwing unit. So the riots are having no chance against the snipers and the uh, commandos. They are gone, which is a shame because four riots are really important for the next step of the, the base. Anyway, let's hope now... They are going to destroy the barrels, kill the unit. Another decoy, we have five decoys, which it will be really interesting. Uh, might have a chance. I don't have enough units though. That's the problem, and it is a massive problem, because my transport truck is really far away. And uh, I'm trying to... I'm trying to get rid of the walls there and the sniper tower plus the AA. That means more munition for me. I can spawn a little bit more units. Probably they will die. Ugh. That's not really complicated. That's not complicated, but uh, I messed it up at the beginning, which I'm really upset about that. They can't, they can't shoot from there. So I'll put the decoy down. Too many sniper towers, that's the, the biggest problem at the moment. Too many sniper towers and I... Okay, that's good. Ah, and it's another part of the base. No, there are too many sniper towers and uh, I didn't have the uh, focus fire. You see, you can't be lucky or unlucky. Now I'm risking it with the decoys, with just few units until I get rid of the bunkers there and everything and now they can probably start aiming for no no that that was a mistake you you can be unlucky like me on a fest like this and have a base like this no right no no i'm going to lose it
and it's not really complicated it is complicated but it's possible and this first was one of the best uh, that well I was looking forward to do it all uh, right well we did destroy some uh, some of the base we keep trying okay we got another lot of munition the chemist did its job flamer no flamer died ah struggle well guys I'm sorry that I didn't manage to win this we are going to probably lose it well it's 100% now I still have loads of units but they are far away because I didn't have enough uh, focus fire to get rid of I should have get rid of the snipers at the beginning because I know by now it's been a while for me doing uh, these fasts and it's really important to have all your units together even if there are just a few uh, so I'm going to try to get rid of the snipers I should have done that from the beginning uh, I got too excited eh? I thought I am going to get through the base like it was not there ah I'm going to surrender guys well that's everything for this fest I hope you enjoyed it if you did please leave a like if you have any ideas guys let me know in the comment section if you can please share with your friends also if uh, if you are new here please subscribe if you are already subscribed make sure you turn the notification on so you'll know when I upload my next video and guys I hope you have a great day and as always thanks for watching and so long my friends